I want to you sports picks. I'm Peter Loshak. Uh, his name is Mike Brenner. We're the Odds Couple. We come to you from sportsbookreview.com. It's week 12 in college football. This is our Friday review show. Mike Brenner, uh, we, we, we can let's just throw up the record from uh, we got a lot of crazy stuff going on college basketball yeah. and uh, total you know, chaos. Uh, yeah, pistol. yeah. I uh, I might throw one or two extra picks on, but uh, for the most part, I'm going to stick with uh, with what I've already given. Let's just run down uh, yeah, let's your do picks. Your, your, okay, Mike. Okay. okay, your picks. Uh, what you got here is uh, Virginia Tech plus one. Iowa minus 10. Iowa first half minus six and a half. Then you got a bunch of first halves where you took the pinnacle openers. The pinnacle openers have not come out yet. So, okay. uh, you know, that could be uh, in your favor or against your favor. Ultimately, you'll get better juice on it, but uh, you know, you might get a worse line or a better line. You got Utah first half, Stanford first half, Clemson first half, Michigan first half, Washington first half, and USC first half. Then you also got USC minus 10 and a half, minus 106, Florida LSU over 37 and a half, LSU first half minus seven. That one you took the bookmaker opener, so that one's out. LSU minus 13 and a half, Florida State first half minus 12 and a half, Florida State minus 20 and a half, Ohio State first half minus 13, and Ohio State uh, minus 21 and a half. All right. And wow. now the, the ones that I have, I have, uh, I have uh, Cincinnati tonight plus seven and a half, TCU on the money line. I took that one earlier in the week, minus 195. Rice minus one. I'm feeling nervous about that one. I might take <laughs> that one back. Illinois plus 10 and a half. Virginia plus 10 and a half. Feeling a little nervous about that one as well. Georgia State plus two and a half. Feeling a little nervous about that one as well. <laughs> New Mexico State minus <laughs> nine and a half. Florida Atlantic plus eight. Mississippi State minus one and a half. FIU plus two and a half against Marshall. Rutgers plus 28. San Jose State plus 10. And Virginia Tech plus one. I'm also feeling nervous about that one because Mike Brenner of Virginia Tech, I feel like it might be a look-ahead spot for them. I looked into yeah, their so uh, their scheduling situation, and they really need to win next week against Virginia. This game doesn't actually matter that much to them. Yeah. So, uh, I mean, I know that they want to have, a, I mean, obviously any game against Notre Dame is a big game. But, They're on uh, the road too, right? Yeah, so I don't know. Um, wow. And Notre Dame did play a good game. I mean, they're a team Finally that I got like a good one. Yeah. yeah. So I'm actually, uh, I think I'm going to fade. Uh, I'm going to take that one back. I'm going to take okay. uh, Notre and that's Dame. That's what we I'm do. We help it. each yeah. other out with that. I I'm pulled you off an NBA yeah. game last night, and the Twitter guy I'm said, man, that's teamwork. Which one did you pull me off Milwaukee of? Milwaukee uh, for the full game. Oh, yeah, that's right, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, so uh, <laughs> let you. me see. Uh, How's Virginia? your totals doing? Uh, but doing fine. I didn't get a chance to uh, crunch too many this week, so okay. I crunched some. But, uh, but You will be yeah. tweeting, though, right? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, we'll see. So I'm going to take <laughs> uh, I'm gonna take Notre Dame, uh, uh, pulling that one back, okay. whatever, whatever the line is right now. Um, I like that. I like that a lot. And, uh, yeah, the UTEP one, the line has gone up to two and a half. I just think that uh, might be a little bit overreaction on my part. Uh, I mean, Rice is still a bad team. You know, I will pull that one. I'll, okay. pull, I'll, I'll take UTEP plus two and a half. Might get a uh, might get a uh, a middle on that one. And uh, there are some others that I'm going to add, though. The one I'm going to add, also scheduling issue. I'm going to add a UTSA against a Texas A&M plus twenty seven and a half. Cover that one. Oh, I like that. Collegefootballwinning dot com, and uh, he recommended to play on that one, and I agree with that one. Then uh, let's see. What I like that I, yeah. a lot. Yeah. What else am I thinking about? I'm thinking, You're thinking about, about nine hundred uh, things. I'm I don't sure. know. Yeah, thinking about the Rice under Kansas State Baylor over. Uh, thinking about um, the uh, Old Dominion uh, FAU over. Uh, but I'm not sure what I'm in. And I'm, I'm thinking of adding, of doubling up on New Mexico State uh, so when against do you find Texas time State. to cook dinner and stuff uh, like that. I don't that? know, Mike Brenner. What do you? Oh, I'm also thinking about Tennessee on the first half. Mike <laughs> Brenner, who's do you, Tennessee playing? Well, they're playing uh, Missouri. Ooh. Uh, and, uh, at and, home and, too, and, right? Yeah, it's at home. Uh, Missouri's coming off a win. Mike Brenner, is there anything you want to add? Pull. What do you want to do with your? I want to add Notre Dame. Dame. Okay. Okay. All and right, what so is the best shop line? Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Uh, All right. And I know there's 900 games. I'm sorry about that pistol, but I really think your uh, breakdown. Yeah, Notre Dame uh, it's, it hasn't moved at all, so we can actually give uh, actually Bet Online has Pick'em, so we can both all take right, Pick'em I'm going to go with a Pick'em on that all right. with Notre Dame, okay. and then also yeah. wanted to know if I could add, and I looked mm -hmm. it up, Alabama mm -hmm. to win the national championship for the Futures, oh. if that could be a pick. Uh, nah. Sure, what book? What book do you want? Just name a book. Um, uh, bet Online. Okay, well, I don't know if they have the Futures there. I okay. mean, you got to check this stuff before the, oh, before well, the call. Okay, you're right. You know what? Uh, yeah. I'll just add that next week. Okay. That's right. what I'll do. Okay. Yeah, Pistol Pete, he's clicking. All right, uh, is there anything else you want to add, Mike Brenner? No. Nope, I'm, nope, you've added everything else I wanted mm -hmm. to add, and I'm pretty, I'm pretty good with it, Pete. I feel pretty good about okay. it. Last night got my ass handed to me mm -hmm. with Louisville, mm -hmm. um, but that's okay. I really, really like that Notre Dame pick, though. I, I, I'm going. I, I took Virginia Tech minus one, mm -hmm. but I pulled back with Notre Dame. I think, uh, yeah. I think that's a smart move. All right, and uh, yeah, there's another one that the line has gone down. I'm not exactly sure why, but I think I'm going to give it. Uh, the Northwestern Minnesota total was like 46 and a half, 47 when Damn. it opened. Now it's down to 45 or 44 What's and a half. We know that Northwestern. Western has, uh, you know, somewhat unexpectedly put up uh, big numbers yeah, yeah. down to 44 and a half. I'm not sure what's the cause of this line movement, but I will throw on the over 44 and a half minus 115, which is a uh, which is a Chris line right now. Okay. Uh, let me 
me see. What else do I want to do? Uh, let me see. What else do I want to do here? Um, God, you can't stop them. You can only hope to contain them, baby. Uh, Pistol Pete. O D U F A U over is interesting. Eh, you know what? You know this what? is total just, chaos, uh, though. Yeah, it is. It is kind of. It is kind of total chaos. I do like that FAU. Let me see what the line is. Yeah, it's down to a down to sixty-one. Uh, Florida Atlantic really picked it up uh, offensively recently. All right, I'll throw that one okay. as well. The uh, the Jeez. over sixty-one uh, minus one ten in uh, in Old Dominion and Florida Atlantic. And I just I'll just I guess I'll just leave it at that. Okay. No reason to go uh, nuts on all oh, the other means. Well, you already went nuts, Pete. Yeah. So that's <laughs> you can't change that. Let's see. All right. I guess that's about it. Yeah. I guess that's about it. Okay. I'm ready. Right, I'm ready yep. for a solid weekend. I need it. My viewers need it. And uh, Pete, most importantly, though, these guys are great. Our Twitter for followers. Sure. They're not Absolutely. beating us up when we're down. Thank yes. you, guys. We can't do it without you. All right. So we will uh, be back on Monday for the opening lines for College Football Week 13. Yes. Let's get it done, Pistol. Go to sbrodds.com. Browse, compare, and shop live odds available at top online sportsbooks.